Hey everyone, Vince94 here, and today I have something pretty exciting to show y'all. So here's the Earthbound Music Editor, and um, I've got it open to the Instruments tab here. So me and Bluestone and a bunch of other PK Hack folks have been working on a tool to um, import custom instruments into Earthbound. Here's an example of one of the like simplest custom instrument packs you could have. It's just a single cycle square wave. Actually, it actually comes from the VST C700. If you've like used that, it's a uh, VST plugin that you can use in a program like FL Studio, and um, it's the square wave that just automatically pops up when you open it. So here. I've, I've got everything broken down into what everything is like the program that, that I made like just spits out all these numbers with nothing in between but I've actually like broken it up into what everything is so here's the size of the pointers it's four numbers and so that's what this is and then this is the audio RAM offset where this is going or the game's going to put this information it's um 6C68 and these like RAM offsets are the same for every like every like uh, instrument pack in Earthbound so uh, that is where in RAM that is gonna go so here is the size of the VRR file and here's the RAM offset where that's gonna go here's um, the patches which is basically um, like the instrument metadata, it's the ADSR and the um, tuning information. So here's how many numbers that is, one, two, three, four, five, six, and here's the RAM offset where the game's going to put that, and zero, 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 zero for the end of transfer. I had, I had a bug where I was just could not figure out what the heck was wrong with it, and all it was missing was this. Um, so yeah, that's fun. Um, so uh, here is an example of like the, the the Chrono Trigger Choir and Piano. It's just a bunch of numbers that it spits out, but it's bas it's basically this, but with more like with different instruments. And I haven't uh, I haven't put the comments in between everything. So this is what it this is what it spits out, and it automatically repoints the pointer table. To, um, to point to this stuff instead of what was in the vanilla ROM. So uh, we don't have to worry about overwriting other instruments that are in there. So um, this is going to hopefully open up a lot of possibilities for custom music and Earthbound ROM hacks in the future. And I'm really excited to like experiment it and like, try to break all of this in new ways because we've already, um, this square wave, it loops in game, but it doesn't loop when you like, mess around with it in the music editor, which means that there's something wrong with the way EVMuseEd Ed deals with loop points. And one of the Pika Hack folks actually found exactly what was wrong and what we need to do to fix it, which is crazy because the EVMuseEd Ed source code has always been kind of an enigma to me. But yeah, I'm really excited to see 
what kind of cool stuff we can make with this. And um, I'm so happy that this is finally working. Um, and I'll see y'all on Friday. Thank you for watching. Thanks.